Hey everyone, welcome back to Private Origin where we take deep dives into history with a side of humor and a dash of curiosity. Today we're unraveling the mystery of Colonel Edward Mandel House. Who was he, and what spooky prediction did he make about the citizens of the United States? Stick around because this story is a real page-turner. All right, let's set the stage. It's the early 20th century, and the world is buzzing with change. Enter Colonel Edward Mandel House, a man with no military background despite his title, but with a lot of influence in political circles. Colonel House was born in 1858 in Texas, and while he never served in the military, he was a key advisor to President Woodrow Wilson. Think of him as the power behind the throne, the Yoda to Wilson's Luke Skywalker. Now Colonel House had some pretty intriguing ideas. He was deeply involved in shaping U.S. domestic and foreign policy during Wilson's presidency. But what really gets the conspiracy theorist buzzing is his prediction, or should we say his eerie foresight, about the future of American citizens. In his novel, Philip Drew Administrator, published in 1912, House envisioned a future where the U.S. government would transform into a quasi-socialist state, guiding citizens towards a utopian society. Sounds like a sci-fi plot, right? In the book, Philip Drew is a benevolent dictator who takes control of the U.S. government to implement progressive reforms. House's vision included a centralized bank, social security, and income tax, concepts that were quite radical at the time. He wanted all people to register their biological property, their children and the people became property as well. He wanted to see people be stripped from their rights. If anyone is to figure things out, they will be plausible deniability. And guess what? Many of these ideas eventually came to fruition in the form of the Federal Reserve and the New Deal policies. So, was House a prophet or just a very persuasive advisor with a knack for policymaking? Some folks think he had a crystal ball, but in reality, he was deeply embedded in the political landscape, pushing for the changes he wrote about. Welcome to the future, I'm Colonel House and I predict income tax. Ha ha ha, but seriously, his influence on American policy was no joke. He had a hand in the creation of the Federal Reserve, which fundamentally changed the way the U.S. economy operates. The Federal Reserve was established in 1913, just a year after his book was published. Coincidence? Maybe. But it's clear that House's ideas were more than just fiction. They were blueprints for a new United States. Now whether you think Colonel House was a genius, a puppet master, or just a man with big dreams, one thing's for sure, he left an indelible mark on United States history. And hey, it wasn't a good plan for the people. Thanks for joining us on this historical journey with a twist. If you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to Private Origin, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Got questions or want to share your thoughts? Drop a comment below. We love hearing from you. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring.